My legs don't hurt as much now because I've worked them. But oh my god, you should hear them. It's like cray cray, cray cray. I'm old. <laughs> but I'm doing it. You know what I'm saying? <sighs> like, it sounded like bamboo for a second. <laughs> when I first started, I was like, damn, my legs, <laughs> my knees are breaking. <laughs> they can break from underneath me. All right. butter going over there and time for chicken just so y'all see what I'm doing bring that over a little closer I don't want chicken juice all over the place for a few minutes and I'll throw that tequila juice right in there. Yum. That's gonna be so good. I didn't actually, I should have like mixed the, the spices before and then tasted it first, but you know, I do concoctions like this all the time and nobody's dead yet and they keep coming back for more, so. <laughs> yeah, okay, this is bothering me. I don't like this on my hands. I'm not gonna like super super wash my hands even though I should but you know. I'm so excited, excited for this. I'm hungry. I'm sorry. But I've been, if I'm going to snack, I'm like snacking on like, I snacked on some carrots the other day. And then I got, I mean, salsa is usually low in fat, I guess. So, and I got these and they're actually pretty slamming. So, I had a few of these, so I think I'm about done with those, but yeah, that's what I was snacking on, so. Oh, and then I got some of these, because why not, you know. Um, I'm going to be snacking on those, and I'm going to be making my breakfast with those, too. I'm going to start making my refrigerator oatmeal, because that stuff's pretty good. What are you crying for? you not have? Does the bull puss not have any? Does the bull puss not have? Do you not have chicken? I'm sorry, but it's not for bulls. Not for bulls. Alright, I think I can turn this down now and just let it cook slow. So it can absorb all that nice juicy tequila <laughs> and butter. So I'm just going to turn that down to a simmer. And I'm actually going to add some extra cheese because cheese. <laughs> I said I'm going to like, I'm trying to like lose a little bit of weight and I am and I will. 
But right now, it's got to, you know, I can't just cut myself off. You know what I'm saying? It's got to take it in stride. You know what I'm saying? So, I'm going to grab some cheese and shred some cheese and ooh la la. Ooh, there's corn too. There's some leftover corn. I'm going to add that to the enchilada. Mm, yummy. I'm so bad. We don't have any leftover rice because I would have thrown that on there too. And it's a little too late in the process of making food to make Spanish rice, so. But that's okay. I don't need that much starch anyway. Now my back hurts from just standing here. Oh God. My back was hurting me, baby. My back is hurting. Help me, help me, help me. I sound like, what's his name? Lindsey Graham? Say, help me, somebody, help me, somebody. He's winning in the polls. Help me, help me. He's running all his money. Oh my God, help me, somebody, help me. <laughs> Uh, what a loser. Uh, Alright, that's more than enough cheese. <sighs> okay. Ooh. I am a little dizzy. That's not good. Whoops. <laughs> but then I haven't, like, slowed down in, like, hours. I've been on my feet, walking and running around. Haven't had a break. This is why... <laughs> I did sick. Alright, so let's look at these little pieces of chicken here. Definitely not about to eat all of these. Definitely not. Alright, so this is what it looks like. So Put that in there. And then, hey, get yourself away from here. Don't make me have to kill you. <laughs> oh, one piece of corn, whatever. And then, smother it with cheese. Because I'm about to put the things back in there. Are you? Are you really? Yes. Yes, who I am. Your mama. read and watched is that you take extra virgin olive oil and by the way I did not know that the best hair I mean the best oil to use if you're going to use olive oil is to use the extra virgin one I didn't know that learn something new every day anyway why do I keep doing that it's like I don't know <laughs> like all retarded <laughs> anyway so they said to use some extra virgin olive oil and then cook the carrots in it for a few minutes 
and then, or until, I guess, they're soft, to get, like, you know, whatever juices or whatever is in the carrot into the oil, and then bottle it up. So, here we go. Wait, never smell. All right, so, she's a wee bit. Uh-oh, who's calling me? Somebody's calling me. Oh no, I got a message from somebody. I don't know. So, that's about all I'm doing this time, just so I can see. Well, maybe a little more. Let's turn it down a little bit more. Add a little bit more. So, there's about that much in there. And then I'm just going to add some carrots. And I think these four carrots should do the trick. I'm a little dubious, a little skeptical. But while my enchiladas are going and while this is going, I'm going to blend my carrots. So apparently I did it wrong. I wanted to just make sure so I looked at what I was watching to see it. I was supposed to like shave or you know uh, get the carrots like in tiny little like shreds. I did not do that. So what I'm gonna do, <laughs> I took them out and I put them in my Ninja <laughs> and I'm just gonna like shred them real quick. Not enough to like I guess pulverize them and then throw them back in the oil for like a few minutes. Get down. So I guess there it is. And then I'm gonna pour it back in the oil. Watch this make a mess and it's gonna pop me and I'm gonna burn. Watch. It's, ah, I just wanted to try something for my hair. Oh, okay, well fine. in there so let that cook for a few minutes until well I wouldn't say a few minutes it's supposed to cook until the um, until like the carrots have like kind of turned brown so I guess I think I'm gonna have to probably add a little bit more oil so let me do that real quick because it looks like the, the carrots have like sucked up all the oil <laughs> Add a little bit more. The things we do for our hair. Hmm. Alright. Ooh, smells carroty. Alright, well. I don't know if you can see it a little bit it's starting to turn brown a little bit so it's working okay and so with the rest of the carrots that I have I put it in here with some aloe vera juice and now I just blend it and then after that I'm gonna add peppermint oil and some uh, lavender oil and maybe some tea tree I have to look at the thing again <laughs> but yeah, I know I got that right. So let's get this blended. <laughs> Loudness. Oh. <laughs> so this is what it looks like. I don't know if I'm supposed to refrigerate this. After, I don't know, but it smells... Awfully carroty. 
And look at that. I think maybe I'll strain the oil first. And then... Because um, I got it. one of these little, little stockings from the dollar store. <laughs> dollar store is really handy for, like, hair stuff. I'm going to strain it through there, and then I'll strain the carrot water, carrot juice through it, because, I mean, I'd rather have the oil in, like, the spray than water in the oil, if that makes sense. I guess we'll see how this goes. <laughs> So I'm gonna strain that one, the, the juice in a cup, <laughs> and then I'll strain the oil in a ramekin. That should work. Just stick it on there, just like that. One-handed, you fiend, one-handed. And then just can kind of like pull it up a little bit. I think. No. <laughs> And then, I think, this is very interesting. America is looking at you. People around the world are looking at you, acting ass over, I don't know what, you being crazy. Crazy puppy. let that sit because it's smoking hot because it's oil and then I'll squeeze it when it gets cooled off a little bit and then I will do <laughs> oh my god now there's the chicken I don't know what happened to the enchiladas it like fell apart or just I don't know it's too juicy or something I don't know you cannot pass not for both but yeah. Okay, you guys. So, I have the oil, and this is what it's looking like. It smells not super carroty, but look, it's like really yellow. <laughs> I hope this doesn't stain my clothes <laughs> when I do put it on. <laughs> and then there's the carrot juice that I have blended and strained. Throw that over there. So this is how that's looking. I need to actually start drinking carrot juice. It's supposed to be really good for you. I didn't actually have an extra spray bottle, so I found another one of my little condiment bottles. So I'm just gonna put it in there until tomorrow until I get another spray bottle. And I'll try it this weekend. But yeah. pouring. Leave it, bow. Don't try and lick that. Not for bows. And then this, I'm going to try and pour it in this little bottle without making a freaking mess because this is oil. So, let's see how steady my hand is. Alright, so, there's the carrot oil. Very interesting. I'm so, I'm so excited to try this. <laughs> hmm. I wish I could do it tonight, but, yeah, I'm not about to untwist all of this right now. Because I actually want to get a cute twist out tomorrow, since tomorrow's Friday. And, wear it for a couple of days. <laughs> it's going to be sweaty, because I have a... Um, I have Zumba tomorrow. Safe Zumba. And get, leave Kitty alone. Get out. And, um, I have to run and pick up, um, somebody's Christmas present tomorrow. Shh, don't tell anyone. <laughs> don't tell anyone. 
Um, but yeah, that's the last gift I have to pick up. So, well, actually, no, it's not. I still have to get Kai Kai something, and I gotta get Jahayla something. So she she cut all her hair out. So now she looks a little bit like Grace Jones. If y'all don't know who she is, y'all should Google Gross Grace Jones. Did I say Gross Jones? Anyway, so I'm about to sit on my ass now because <laughs> I've had a long day of standing and running and exercising. <laughs> so I'm going to sit down and take a break probably for the rest of the evening because it's what time is it? Damn, it's almost eight o'clock at night. Yeah, I'm done. <laughs> so I will catch y'all in the next one. If you guys like this video, please like, share, and subscribe. And Quick reminder, I almost forgot. I'm not done with the damn carrot juice yet. Ugh. Okay, so um, what the lady does for her carrot juice is she adds rosemary oil, which I have not made yet because I haven't gotten around to it. <laughs> I have fresh rosemary and I'm going to use that. Um, but that'll probably be um, a project for this weekend and I'll probably film that too. Um, but I do have peppermint oil, which I'm going to use. Um... She also uses vitamin E oil, um, about like a tablespoon of that, but because I have the lanolin oil and that's supposed to like lock in moisture or some crap, I'm going to use that. <laughs> this is my own little experimentation. So 10 drops, she said 10 drops of the peppermint oil. So come on now. There's two in there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Ah! Seven. Come on. Eight. Nine. <laughs> Ten. All right. Cool. Uh-oh. This is, that's why it's hard to come out. It's like, there's very little in there. I don't know how to get that out, but, ooh, that's strong. Pepperminty. Um, I will figure it out. Um. And so, and because instead of the rosemary, I'm going to use lavender. So I'm going to put this in the fridge because I don't, I don't trust it <laughs> to leave it out. <laughs> so I'm going to put it in the fridge until I'm ready to use it. Um, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ha ha. Ha. All right. I have to crack open to my other bottle of peppermint here. Oh, I've got to order some more here fairly soon um but anyway um and the lanolin so i've yet to use it i poured a little bit in my oil mixture so and i don't know my i used it and my hair feels fairly soft it's not like super dry or anything like it usually is around this time so i don't know anyway so i'm gonna put about about a teaspoon in there That seems like a teaspoon, maybe, maybe a little less. I don't know. Do it your own. Um, I'm going to put it on here, shake it up, and then it'll be ready to go for this weekend. I'm so excited to use it. Yay. I need to, like, actually do some research and see how long this stuff lasts. Oh, um, my camera's doing that weird thing again. What I was saying is... I wonder how long this stuff lasts, so I'll have to do some research. But anyway, you shake it up. Yeah, you're being filmed, fool. Anyway, shake this up. And it's ready to go. Alright, that's enough. Alright. I'm out of here. I'll catch you guys 